In this game, you will encounter a variety of visual effects that may provoke seizures or loss of consciousness in a minority of people. If you or someone in your family has ever displayed symptoms of epilepsy in the presence of flashing lights, please consult your physician before playing Cyberpunk 2077. If you or someone you know experiences any of the above symptoms while playing, stop and seek professional medical help. Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Cyberpunk 2077. V, listen. I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. The number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Now, that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds. But I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tack hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, well, and I'll you. send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. Hmm. Okay. There are various ways to incapacitate enemies without killing them. Non-lethal takedowns, non-lethal quick hacks, non-lethal weapons, EMP grenades and some combat gadgets, and weapon mods that change damage to non-lethal. If a given weapon, combat gadget, or quick hack deals non-lethal damage, it will be mentioned in the description. Fair enough. Alright. Anyway, when we left off, as I was rudely interrupted by Regina, uh, we were uh, getting some upgrades to ourselves after a uh, quick sleep off of uh, what happened while I was doing that job. Uh, there was a bit of a bug in my system as well, but we got that taken care of as well. So we're good. Uh, we got upgrades to the eyeball and hand, which means I can see my ammo counter while I'm doing shit. And uh, it's all good. We're not all good. Also, I just noticed this fucking thing going on here. Just in the middle of the street. Yep. All right. Makes a lot of sense. Do you truly believe that those who have sold you your mechanical eyes have resisted the temptation to peek Gary through them? The prophet. Right. Cameras are all around us, even within us. Your joys, your worries, your life. For them, it is all mere spectacle. And if anyone was watching and giving a damn, I'd have half the city's underworld and half its corpse on my ass already. And if you are their pawn, unknowingly carrying out their secret agendas. Uh-huh. But who are those who follow our every step, you ask? Okay. Why the that Titans didn't go entertainment in Alpha Centauri. about as well as I expected, but hey, it was still something. In their wretchedness, they placate their weary Okay, this guy. I should be avoiding. Alright. What the fuck was all the screaming about? Um. I have no idea what's going on there. But, oh. I have no idea what's going on there either. I'm going to let y'all take care of that. Alright. I have no idea where my car is, but I can call it, right? Yeah, I can call it by pressing the uh, right directional pad button. Oh, okay. I guess I'll go around this way. Well, thank you. Thank you very much. Oh, boy. Here are gunshots outside. Oh, jeez. Yo, Mr. V. A pleasure. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> Let's roll. Uh Mind if I ask you something right Something's off the going on outside. Would you rather He's live just... in pieces, Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? There's some sort of test. Eh, just a pet topic of mine. You mean riddles? No, Mr. V. Ontology. No. No way. All right. So Listen I, close. I, I can't. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scab home. 
Hang on. I got a question of my own now. Why all this, Dex? Why me? Could have had Jackie or T-Buck sitting here. Could have just done this on comms. Call me old-fashioned, but I like to look anyone I do biz with in the eye. Had All the right. pleasure of meeting the Jackster in the past. And sweet T-Bug helped this brother out two years ago. So here we are. Okay. Besides all that, got a special little pre-mission just for you. Hmm. But we'll get to that. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech. A biochip to be precise. Job's to grab it. Simple. Okay. Yeah. Guessing it belongs to a corp. Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. Not particularly. But, I mean... <laughs> Corps don't deserve special treatment. Shit. <laughs> you ain't playing around. Got a feeling this could be a start of a beautiful friendship built on heaps of eddies. You work well, this out? I mean, that's a good Got way a plan? to look at it. Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Mm -hmm. Needs active resolve in that. Second, the rendezvous. Simple. Client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. Oh, yeah? Client. What's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Mm -hmm. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End of convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted oh. on meeting someone with skin okay. in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Which would be me. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Yeah, that's true. Sure. Alright, so I'm the... Uh... I'm the one doing the customer service rep. All right, fair enough. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot and shot. Got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a military convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, Convoy was carrying the Flathead, a little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high-grade military tech. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of a brick. Mm -hmm. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate, one Simon Randall, a.k.a. Royce, plain dropped his ass. Jesus. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this ship's truth, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Royce guy, what's he like? A straight psychopath. Chrome-loving kind. Big club in this town. I'll give you that. Except few of its other members. No matter the stakes, would put a friend and associate through an industrial microwave dryer. Jesus. Apparently, first thing to burst are the eyeballs. Get a nice clear pop. Then the rest goes goulash. I mean, I figured that, but also didn't need the visual. Uh... Who's the prima donna? Corpo agent. Internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking oh. after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The it one might. lady she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter. So she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. I just noticed the eyes glowed when he said that. Fair enough. I think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. All right. One more thing, Mr. V. Okay. 
quiet life or a blaze of glory? Hmm? Later now. Hmm. Okay. Posing the question again, but only after we've discussed all the uh, job details. All right. Performing certain actions will reward you with street cred. Build your street cred to make a name for yourself in the Night City underworld. Doing so will open up new opportunities. All right. Fair enough. Jagster, talk to Dex. <laughs> yeah, Gordito's a big deal. Literally and not, yeah. Literally and not. Jesus. Quit calling him fat, man. He's, he's not that bad. Guy certainly knows how to protect his biz. Wants to put us on a few small kinks. Prep work, I guess. Before lining us up a big job. There's this combat bot. Military prototype. Maelstrom clept it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had a switch up in management. Right, right. Heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agent, too, but... I don't know how much help she stands to be. Ha! <laughs> Chingon. Hey, you don't sound thrilled. Royce, what do you know about him? He's fucking whack something special. Junkie snort junk. Royce snorts chrome. Okay. So he is very much in the, uh, wanting to get more robot as time goes on. All right. Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. He must know what he's doing. So, how you wanna play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? Might as well do the customer service rip out first. It's what I'm good at, after all. That's basically what I do hey, all fucking day at work. With me, I think I yeah, ought to see her I'm first. About to. See what she's like, what she's after. What I lay. In that case, I'll hit the all foods. Put my nose to the ground. Sniff around. Hasta luego. Fair enough. Hasta luego. Alrighty. Time to go talk with, uh, with the client. But first, I gotta go to Lizzie's bar between uh, 6 p.m. and 6 a.m. Pick up. Oh, I see. Huh. Mr. V, I just want to remind you again that Eddie's have already changed hands between me and my esteemed Maelstrom partners and biz. A round sum of 10,000 euro dollars to be precise. So when you're there to take it off their hands, don't let them try to shake it down as they're liable to do Maelstrom being Maelstrom. Thanks for the info. You'll need it. Best of luck. Alright. Got other messages I got as well. A couple of words about who you gain you going, rather, up against. Kabuki. Won't spoil this, just come and see. Uh, Ario? Ario? I don't... I can't read that that well. Buck, 6th Street Ganger, real piece of shit. Alright. Glenn, Caesar, fists like fucking hammers. Animals Club, Rhino, woman's a legend, lays everyone flat. Fair enough. And then, it's one from Biochip Info. How about a little something to get those taste buds tingling? The biochip in question is in fact the so-called relic. A Nova tier piece of tech catering to the top 1%. That's what we were hearing about earlier. Supposedly the best life insurance money can buy. You and I are going to be neck deep in euro dollars. Move your ass, I say. Dex is waiting on us. Alright, fair enough. I got a level up too. Shit. Didn't even notice. Alright, um. Let's get all rounded in this first. Um. Purchase the level up here. But, uh. I wanna. 
get into this. Crafting and engineering. Uh, gain more components when disassembling. Junk items are automatically disassembled. Allows you to craft rare items. And I could go with that. So eventually I'm going to be getting into a building shit. When looting drones, mechs, and robots, there is a 25% chance of looting a weapon mod or attachment. Oh man, I wish I could have known that earlier. I would have done that. Uh, Tesla. Can't touch this. Grants immunity to all effects from your own grenades. Man, that is really useful. Wish I had known. God damn it. Alright, um. Oh. The percentage went up. Uh, rather, the uh, DPS went up. So it went up to 65.3. And this is 56.3. Okay. That's weird. Don't know why the DPS went up. Alright. I just noticed that I'm not wearing my jacket. So I'm going to put that on. Uh, which one... Do I like more? Uh. Yeah, I like the look of this more. I like the look of this more, honestly. Alright, we'll go with that. Okay. Alright, call Militech Agent Meredith Stout. Uh... Oh, I have to hold it down to be able to do that. All right, fair enough. Stout here. Start by telling me how you got this number. No more than your number. Heard you misplaced a convoy. You shut him up. Spill what you okay. know. Okay. Don't make me wait. Nuh uh Not on the horn. Let's meet. Cut a deal. A deal. Fine. First exit off Skyline, driving towards the NID. Storm Channel under the overpass. Meet you there. Meet up with the Militech agent. All right. All right. Let's go that way. That is quite a ways away, though. Jesus. Uh, call my car. The Hella. The Hella ECD. I uh, didn't catch the rest. That's fine. Alrighty. Oh, Jesus. Alright, alright. Let's fucking. Alright, let's try and go around this way. Oh, Jesus. Uh, radio. Hmm. You gonna move? Guess not. Alright, well, fuck you. Jackass. <laughs> Alright. Okay. Alright, 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 alright. Could you move faster, please? Jesus. Okay, here we go. Let's be slower around cops, huh? Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Shit, I do not drive good in first person. Switch camera. Oh! There is a way to switch camera. That's better. I only just noticed that. Good thing I did. Fuck, I drive like an asshole in a first person. Definitely slow down. Enter in north side. Alright. All right. See how much better I drive when I'm in third person? See how much less of an asshole I drive like? Which is weird because in real life I'm actually a good driver. I know I've said that a million times, but I am not lying. Ah, fuck. Okay, well, disregard what I just said. All right. Well, 
Well, hi there. Look lively. Meredith Stout. Take it you were the one to call? Yes, I was. Oh, jeez. That'd be me. Whoop! Up. Mm. Thought you could blackmail me, fucker! Set conditions! I mean, yeah, a little. Got any more for me? Calm the fuck down! We just wanna talk! Whoa, whoa, who the fuck is he? Christ, Meredith! Shut your trap! That fucking thing ready? All set. Now answer my questions. Honestly. Forthrightly. Are you here alone? Got guardian angels with 50 caliber snipes aimed at your skull. You don't let me go. Your dogs will have to glue you back together. He's lying. Try that again, and it's two million volts. No. Got it? Shit. Do a sweep now. Contact? Is he the one who leaked intel on the convoy? That guy? Never seen him before. Checks out. Listen, I know where the transport is. I can help you. Just want a favor in return. <sighs> I told you! I fucking told you! I'm not the mole! Jesus Christ! Shut him up! Unhand me now before I. <sighs> Good luck, bud. Because you ain't getting any more luck. Go. I hear what he has to say. Okay. Could could we put the guns down, please? Couldn't have been chill from the start. Shut the fuck up. All right. Tell me what you want. Shit. God damn it. You want info? I want a bot. Let's make a deal. I need a bot. Flathead model. Guys who ripped you off have it. Promise me that bot. I'll point the finger. You have a plan how to deal with them? Could just take it by force, but they're expecting payment, so I could go that route too. Fine, the latter, but on one condition: you pay with our money. Oh, do I? Sounds solid enough. I'm in. Some shards you find in the world will contain information hidden behind a data encryption measures. Okay. To decrypt a shard, first either open it through the notification when you acquire it, or find it later in the shards tab under journal in the main menu. Then select crack security to unlock its secrets. You pay with that chip, and that's all you gotta worry about. Try to fuck me in any way, and I'll be seeing you real soon. I mean... That's fair enough. You're making a mistake! Um, okay. Also, where'd my car go? Son of a bitch. <laughs> there it is. Okay. Moved over there for some fucking reason. That's fine, I guess. Okay. Well, um. Apparently took some damage and I didn't realize. Um. Let's go into journal and, uh, oops, deal with that shard. Uh, shards. There we go. Militech data shard. Crack security. Okay. Uh. Oh. There we go. Neutralize malware. Okay. Oh, I could have copied the malware. Ah, oh, shit. Well, I didn't know that. Demons uploaded. All right. Fair enough. All right. Property of Militech. Unauthorized access is strictly prohibited. Eddie's on the cred ship or queen. Nice. Just annoyed that I didn't know that I could just copy it. God damn it. God damn it. That would have been nice to have. I am halfway tempted just to save scum. 
safe's coming. Do that again. But I'm not gonna. Not this time, anyway. Alright. Time to get back up and meet with Jackie. Ah! I really ought to learn to not do that. Turn too sharply because I'm trying to keep in my lane. Fuck that. Alrighty. Here we go. And we... Yeah, there we go. Once I'm on the open road, I'm good. I don't know what this is about. I kind of want to find out. What is this? Oh! Fast travel spot? It is! Alright. You can go to a fast travel location by placing your cursor on it and pressing A. I just noticed that, yeah, my it is my PC being loud. That's what the worrying is about. Okay. Well, good to know. Um, at least it's, uh, at least it's holding steady. All right, fair enough. Whoa. Okay, well. I was trying to back out of that, but, uh, worked out in the end, I guess. All right, let's back out of here. Stand here. The sun is down, but I hope you're still up. Is it a mirage? A hologram? No, my friends, it's clear, open skies. But don't take it from me. Get out there and enjoy the sun. Oh. oh. I can just drive through this, huh? Ish. Okay, well, I have, uh... <laughs> All right, well, so much for that. Oops, doodle. Um, if I move far enough away from the car, I can call it again. Just sprint a little bit. I'm probably wrong on this. Oh. Stamina is only going slightly further down. Yeah. Oh, hey! I was correct. <laughs> it did work. Alright, let's get back in. Alright. I have no idea what else have to do to get through that. Okay. I just had to fucking do it faster, I guess. Alright. Fine with that. But you know what? I kind of want to see other stuff. Uh, the danger is moderate in this. Psycho killer is very high. Paid in full. Um, hmm. The gift and the gig. Huh. These are the main jobs, though. Huh. Beat on the Brat Kabuki. You know what? Track this job and do that. Alright. Keep going this route. And, uh... What the fuck? <laughs> well, hey there, buddy. Hiya, Porfin. Let me hear what you squared away. Z Bug show any sign of life? You two talk? She's up to date, fired up to work with Dex. Preparing already. Alright. They're familiar, you know? Worked together before Dex took his break. Okay. Been waiting long? Been waiting long. Mi madre always said patience pays off, so... Fair enough. 
So Dex already paid the Maelstromers for the Corpo bot. Thing is, can't be sure the Gangoons are still willing to hand it over. He paid up front? Ichone. Well, whatever. Let's go get this tech. You scheme yet? You got a plan? Militech and me, we found some common ground. They're footing the bill for the bot. There's a lot of scratch to toss away. True. Get it, Jack. It would be like we never had it in the first place. Anyway, who knows how this deal's gonna shake out. So, into the Borg Beast then? Give me a minute. Okay, tell me when you're good and steeled. Alrighty. Fair enough. So now that that's all squared away, I can get back to what I was gonna be doing. Just doing that side job. I look in my preview window for half a second. God damn it. That music is weird. Yeah, later, Jackie. I'll see you in a bit. I just got some side jobs I want to get done. Ooh, that poppin'. Ooh, that poppin'. I was going way too fast for that. Should have known better. When you go down a hill, you fucking break, idiot. Jesus. That's what my stupid ass should have done. Sitting and waiting near all food. Whoa! Maelstromers having themselves a cookout. Alright, fair enough. Jesus. Alright. There we go. Okay, well, I don't know what's going on here, but... I cannot aim for shit, that's for shit, damn sure. Alright, well, fuck. I'm shooting at my car here. God, I'm not good at this. All right. All right. Come on up. It helps if I can fucking aim. Ooh, reduces the ADS time of your pistols and revolvers by 20%. That ain't too bad. All right. Power weapons allow you to control the direction of bullet ricochets if you have ballistic coprocessor, cyberware, coprocessor, cyberware, and trajectory generator mod for Karashi Optics installed. Cool. Hmm. New item received. Uh, okay. Take that. Ooh. Pulsar. Um, mint pie. <laughs> New item received. All right, fair enough. Um, take all of that. Take that off of you. Take this off of you. Take this off of you. Taking a whole bunch of shit. All right. Well, that was something. I mean, I sucked at it, but I mean, it was still an option. Okay. Got a decent amount of ammo left. I guess. Um, I forget how to fucking heal myself. Because <laughs> of course I do. Um... So scan. God damn it. 
Uh, let me check again. I do not remember how to heal. There we go. That's how I heal. All right. Fair enough. I, you just hit up, and then it heals me all up. Fantastic. All right. Shut up. Jesus. I'm dealing with a whole bunch of shit. You don't get to honk at my car. Could just gone around. Whoop, Jesus. Let's not hit the police. All right. And... It just fucking. <laughs> let's not do that. Let's not do this. Alright. Let's get out of my car. And. Whoop. There we go. That'll work. Where do I go to do this fight? Open. It's locked. Alright. Fair enough. Where do I go to do this? Through this way? I gotta presume it's this way. I have no idea at all. Do I go up? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. I'm going to be wandering around like an idiot until I figure it out. Ooh. Some Euro dollars in here. That's fine with me. All right. Well. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. I don't know how to get in there. Go to the fight in Kabuki. It doesn't tell me much else. Unfortunately. Yeah, it says Devillery again. I gotta assume that was on accident. I gotta assume. Um. Hmm. Huh. <sighs> I have no ideas. I have no ideas on what to do to be able to do the thing. None at all. Talk to you? I don't know you. Okay. Shit. Do I go up here? I don't fucking have any ideas. Alright. Um... I have no clue. I'm just playing it by ear at this point. Oh wait! I was right. I do this go up here. I know where I'm gonna strike before I do it. Uh-huh. Typical for a fight. Which one of you's my guy? Me. Wasn't expecting the tag team. Okay. Whatever, I guess. So, who do I got first? No, no. You don't get it. That body and this one. I'm the same person. So, what? I'm seeing double? I used to be twins, which you could probably guess. The twins had a close bond. They wanted to be closer, stronger. So they installed neural oscillation sinks. And now they're, well, me. me. One, One person, person two, bodies. two bodies. My bodies do everything together. Everything. You really do everything together, even under the sheets. Oh, jeez. I have one girlfriend for both bodies, if that's what you're asking. Shared between both. So, what? One takes waist up and the other's on booty duty? <laughs> no, she's with one body Monday through Wednesday and the other Wednesday through Sunday. Frick. Shit. Whatever. Oh, and if another one of you pops up, I don't mind beating a third ass. You got a sharp tongue, no doubt about it. That Let's I do. See how that helps you when fists start flying. Well, we'll find so, out, won't we? Can, can we, we get, get started? started? Oh, I jumped. Show me what you got. 
Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. There we go. Knocked you out. Oh, jeez. Down you go. Hell yeah. <laughs> Just a flop again. All right. And you? <laughs> had enough like your brother or hungry for more? That ain't my brother. Oh, that's me. Jesus, what's so hard to understand? Uh, Here, enough. Your winnings. I do appreciate it. Thank you. There we go. Good haul. It's a very good haul. Don't worry. There's always the next fight. Stop talking to yourself. <laughs> Listen, out of curiosity, you guys can read each other's thoughts. No, no. Same person, same, person, same, same thoughts. thoughts. Okay. If that were in the case, I'd be on schizoid meds. Incredible. Well, it's good to see you transition from circus ring to boxing ring. Give me a break. Hey, sure the Ripper didn't swap anything else out? Felt like I was fighting against four left hands. Fuck you! <laughs> Fair enough. All right. Couple of words about who you're up. Oh, okay. Won't spoil this, just come and see. Okay. Heard you whip those twin freaks' asses. Good work. Keep it up. Alright. Thank you. I do appreciate it. I keep doing that about the fucking menu. I'm apologizing right now. I'm probably going to do it for a long, long time. <laughs> I'm so used to just canceling on a menu. Uh, that's what I get. But. There we go. It's a nice little fall. I do not want to fall further than that, though. So, uh, I'm gonna... Jump out of here. Go right down these stairs. Whee! Hey, you there. Yes, I'm talking to you. Uh-huh. Are you getting what you want out of life? Let me guess. Food from a tube, rusty water from the tap, another murder outside your bedroom window. But what if... You could leave all that behind. Just ads. Far, far behind when you begin your journey to the final frontier. Send the word SPACE to 7299 for a chance to win a one-week getaway for two at the Crystal Palace. Ten casinos, five pools, top-end brain dance equipment, and the best chefs in the universe. If you're looking for a taste of paradise, don't wait a microsecond longer. Send space to 7299 right now. Already. The Crystal Palace. Feel alive in the dead of space. <laughs> Feel alive in the dead of space. Huh? All right. All right. Fair enough. Fair enough. Okay. The information. What time is it right now? That is not the button I wanted to hit. All right, it's about time I can do that. But first, I want to look at my other things. Paid in full. I don't know how many rippers who'd install Kuroshi Optics on Credit and Faith. In fact, I only know one. Victor, maybe once you're on top, you don't forget about this old guy. Yeah, pay the man what he's due. I do not have that yet. Uh, the gig. Let's go with that. Wait for the lockdown to end. Whenever we go see Wakako and walk into that pachinko salon of hers, my brain for some reason just kind of shut down after pachinko. I get this weird like tingling feeling on the back of my neck. I don't know, V. She's all kinds of weird. Anyway, she promised a special reward for this job with Sandra Dorset. All we have to do is go see her on Jig Jig Street. Well, let's do that. Get the money from it. Fucking... Wait for the lockdown to end. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Didn't mean to. So the lockdown isn't over yet. Is that what you're telling me? All right. That's fair. All right. Okay. Well, in that case, uh, the gift. Retrieve the ping quick hack from the netrunner. T-Bug's probably the last person you'd expect to do presents. She's not exactly the kind of gal who goes around buying novelty coffee mugs or t-shirts of your favorite comic book hero, but a Netrunner program for you? For the job? Shit, she must really like you, S.A. <laughs> Alright. I could do that. 
But again, I gotta do another fucking U-turn, which is something. All right. That car was not there. The fuck? All right. Time to whoop. Time to back up again. There we go. I need to pay attention to the map a little bit more. Just paying attention to the, uh, what's around me. Oof. That was probably havoc on the suspension. There we go. There we go. Go around you, because fuck you. Off your horn all you want. Oh, look, I can look behind and uh, honk my horn with the other stick. Okay. Left stick is honk, right stick is look behind me. That's fair. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. There are a lot of gunshots. Sort of gun down there. Not sure what to think about that. There's a gun pointed down there. No problem. Oops, sorry. Didn't mean to do that. Whatever I did. Oh, it's a gun shop. That's what uh, that is. Hey, how's it going? Scabs give you a lot of trouble around here. Some days, sure. Other days, eh, not so much. But me personally, well, they know better. Good to hear. All right. We're going to buy some new iron. A few dozen pounds. Well, be my fucking guest. Well, there we go. One's based on street cred. The Defender, huh? Huh. How about that? Right. One-handed club. It's a tomahawk. What the fuck you mean, one-handed club? Oh. This knife is uh, a little stronger than what I currently got, but then again, it's an uncommon knife. That makes sense. Uh, okay. This ammo. Okay. Fair enough. Weaken. Crafting spec for the copperhead. Hmm. Crafting spec for the pulsar. Crafting spec for the Lexington. Uncommon item components. Bunch of good quality components used to craft items. Alright, fair enough. Silencer. Okay. Crafting spec for the Nekomata. Hmm. Fair enough, but I'm looking at my stuff here. Physical damage, electrical damage. Hmm. Decent submachine guns here. Huh. This one is physical damage and does more than the other copperhead I got. Huh. Okay, some of this I'm going to have to look uh, look at on my own time. So, uh, I did that again. Uh, so, for the time being, I'm going to end the episode here for right now. I'm going to look at some of the other stuff uh, in a second. Uh, deal with that on my own time. Uh, maybe I disassemble a bit of it and reassemble a little into something cooler. Yeah, maybe. Um, I heard the crafting is pretty overpowered, so crafting stuff on your own is actually pretty good. I might go that route. We'll find out. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share in comments so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one the only Stray Cat. Playing games and slowly making my way around Night City. And, uh, you know, getting jobs set up and finishing some other jobs. And all that fun stuff. Uh, I'll be finishing up some other jobs in just a second. After I figure out my inventory. For you.